The name of this book is Chicken Big, written by Keith Graves and read to you by Nisi. What should we call this book? How about chicken kind of large? Or tall chicken, chicken tall? No, 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 chicken salad. Wait, I'm having a brainstorm. Let's call it chicken big. That's it. On a teeny tiny farm in an itty bitty coop, a very small hen laid a big humongous egg. Brrr. The egg began to shake. The egg began to quake. Out popped a big humongous chick. What is it? crowed the little rooster. It's big, clucked the small chicken. It's enormous, clucked the smaller chicken. It's an elephant, peeped the smallest chicken. She was not the sharpest beak in the flock. He's too big to stay in our itty bitty coop, crowed the little rooster. Much, much too big, clucked the small chicken. He'll break the floor, clucked the smaller chicken. Indoor elephants are dangerous, squawked the smallest chicken. I don't feel like an elephant, thought the big chick. I wish I were a chicken. And the sign says, no elephants allowed. The next day, an acorn fell and cocked the smallest chicken on the head. The sky is falling, she peeped. Run for your lives. Burk, burk. So the chickens ran for their lives. Don't worry, said the big humongous chick. It's only an acorn. They're actually quite tasty. I don't think elephants eat acorn, said the little rooster. I heard they only eat popcorn, clucked the small chicken. Maybe he's not an elephant, clucked the smaller chicken. The smallest chicken looked closely at the big, humongous chick. Ah, my mistake, she peeped. He must be a squirrel. A squirrel, thought the big, humongous chick. Later on, the smallest chick was pecking her worms when a raindrop splatted on top of her head. Splat! The sky is leaking, she peeped. We're all going to drown. We'll all drown. Run for your lives. And the chickens ran for their lives again. Burk, 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 burk.